Okay. So. That's bad. This time. Okay. Hello. My name is Shadowflow, and I am going to show you sort of a quick way to gain EXP while grinding for the level trophies. Um, you might have heard of the strategy of staying in the room past the final um, portal and just healing using Great Flame Slash and then just repeating, just resting, getting your energy back. Um, there is a slightly faster way and I'm going to show that to you right now. Um, one of the things you're going to have to do, you're going to have to wait until you get to a formation with these raccoons. And they actually have the ability to call more allies. So this is the start of the battle. And what I'm going to do, I'm actually going to guard with both you and my partner. And I've seen as many as three allies get called. Um, I'm not sure if four can get called, but we're going to see how many I can get now. I'm actually going to do it again, just to see if I can get more. Okay, that's six total. Now, I don't know how many can actually populate the battle, but I've seen as many as seven at one time. So I'm actually not going to use Great Flame Slash just yet. I'm actually going to use Tailwind, then jump slash. As you can see, it doesn't kill everybody. Another one in the back. Okay. It does, in fact, call another ally. And I'm going to go ahead and take this one down. And show you the EXP gain. I was hoping that one would give it too. That's fine. So, as you can see, you get 7,000 EXP per raccoon, and it just dropped, this battle just dropped 4,900 total. And on top of that, if you're using the treasure trunk strategy that you get from the Dream Eater 3 side quest, whatever party member is equipped with that will now get a bonus 2450, if my math is right. And so, any battle you can do this with as long as it has raccoons in it. As you can see, I have it equipped to Cybat because I've already got you to level 50. And I'm trying to grind out these trophies. This is insane. Um, I think I found this by accident. I just guarded by accident, essentially. But I'm not sure how far you can keep doing this into a battle. I try not to do it too much because I've heard reports of the games crashing. And I want to avoid that and just come out and save. So, this is what I found. I hope it helps anybody who's really going for this trophy. Um, it may not be much. It's still grinding. I'm actually um, showing this two hours into my stream. I'm not even going to edit it. I'm just going to like maybe clip it out of my video. But if this helped, I'm really happy it did. And please give me a, f you know, maybe check me out on my Twitch channel. Twitch.tv slash Shadowquill. Um, and that's pretty much it. Um, I hope you enjoyed it, and good luck on getting this platinum trophy. This is a fantastic game. So, bye.